Hello friends, this video on quadrilaterals part 11 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Question number 8. Find the measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon of 9 sides of 15 sides. So we have learned that the sum of the exterior angles for any polygon, doesn't matter how many sides are present in that polygon, sum of the exterior angles will always be equal to 360 degree. So we have to find out the measure of each exterior angle. Now for a polygon with n sides, if the polygon has n sides, how many angles it will have? If the polygon has n sides, that means it will have n number of angles. So, if the polygon has 9 sides, the polygon would have 9 angles. So, let us say each angle is equal to x. Therefore, x added 9 times would be 9x. So, 9x would be equal to 360 degree or we can say x will be equal to 360 divided by 9. So this would be equal to 40 degrees. Therefore, the measure of each external angle would be 40 degrees. Now similarly for the second one which has 15 sides. So 15 sides means it would have 15 angles. So here we will just replace 9 with 15. So 15x will be equal to 360 degree. So x will be equal to 360 divided by 15 which will be equal to 24 degrees. Let's look at question number 9. How many sides does a regular polygon have if each of its interior angles is 165 degrees? So again here it is a regular polygon. So regular polygon itself means that all sides are equal, all angles are also equal. So that means if we assume that let number of sides for this polygon be x. So if there are x number of sides, then there will be how many angles? The number of angles would also be x, right? So in that case, if we assume that we have a regular polygon with x angles, then what would be the sum of the interior angles? So sum of interior angles of a regular polygon with x sides would be equal to x minus 2 into 180 degrees right this would be the sum of the internal angles now in the question it is given that each internal angle is 165 degrees that means as per this question the sum of the angles as per our assumption would be 165 degrees multiplied by the number of angles because this is the measure of one angle and we have assumed that there are x angles so 165 degree into x would be the sum of the internal angles as per our assumption and this should be equal to x minus 2 into 180 degrees because that's as per calculation that for any regular polygon with x sides this should be the sum of the interior angles. Now let us try to solve this to find out the value of x so this would be 165x is equal to 180x minus 360 or we can say that 165x minus 180x is equal to minus 360. This is minus 15x is equal to minus 360 or we can say x is equal to minus 360 divided by minus 15. So minus minus would cancel. So this would be 5 3 is a 15. This is 2 and this would be 24. So the value of x would be 24. Therefore, we would say that there will be 24 sides in this regular polygon. Question number 10. Is it possible to have a regular polygon with each exterior angle as 22 degrees? Now we know that for any regular polygon with how many number of sides, the sum of the exterior angles will always be equal to 360 degree. Now here in the question it is given that each angle is 22 degree. Now let us say that there are n sides of this polygon. 
so if the polygon has n sides that means the polygon has n angles each angle is 22 degree so sum of the angles would be n into 22 degree now this should be equal to 360 degree because that's the sum of the exterior angles so from this if you calculate the value of n it comes out to be 360 by 22 but when you actually find the value you see that it comes out to be 180 by 11 so there is no perfect divisor of this number so we do not get a, a, a whole number so what does that mean that means the now the value of n or the number of sides cannot be 2.25 value of n cannot be 3.5 right it has to be either 1 2 3 4 or whatever it has to be a whole number but that's not the case here so that means that it is not possible to have a regular polygon with an exterior angle of 22 degrees the second part of the question asks, can it be an interior angle of a regular polygon? Okay, so for exterior angle, we it is not possible. How about interior angles? Now for interior angles, this left hand side will remain the same because then we assume that 22 degree is one interior angle. Now if we have assumed that the polygon has n sides, then the sum of the interior angles would be n into 22 degrees. And what do we know? We know that the sum of the interior angles of any polygon with n sides is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree. So this is the change that uh, we'll have for interior angles. So in this case, if we try to solve this, is com this comes out to be 22n is equal to 180n minus 360 or we can say 158n is equal to 360 or n is equal to 360 divided by 158. So here also if you look at this value, we do not get a positive divisor of 158. Therefore, in this case also it is not possible. So you see just two simple concepts of the sum of the interior angles of a polygon and the sum of the exterior angles of a polygon. But based on these two simple concepts, we can frame so many different types of questions. Thank you. Please visit examfear.com for free quality education. You can learn with a simple four-step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons, you can ask your questions, you can refer notes and you can take a free online test. We have content for class 6 to 12 on physics, chemistry, mathematics and biology along with practical videos. So please subscribe to our channel for daily updates. Thank you.